In the ash tree nest, our tawny owl pair, Bonnie and Ozzy, have had chicks. They've grown up fast and they'll soon be ready to fledge. Let's go back to see the moment they hatched. It's the end of May and Bonnie has been incubating her two eggs for a month. And the first is just about ready to hatch. She stands up to reveal the first chick. It's blind, helpless and still damp from hatching. Bonnie soon returns to her chick. She's such a caring mother. That night, she's on guard, hyper alert to any threats. And she hears a noise. A barn owl lands just outside the nest. But thankfully, it's just passing through. Bonnie's determined to keep her chick safe. Tawny owl mothers are extremely protective of their young, so the next day I don't get much more than a glimpse of the hatchling. But as night falls, it's plain to see just how quickly this chick is growing. It's dried off now, showing off its fluffy down, and it's already very active, wiggling around and stretching its tiny wings. All this growing must be tiring work. The following night, Bonnie reveals the second chick. It's hatched out three days after the first. Bonnie seems so pleased the chicks are healthy. But she's finding it hard to sleep with these restless hatchlings beneath her. I watch her carefully feed the chicks, giving them tiny morsels one bit at a time. Later, Bonnie leaves the nest to stretch her wings. But it's not her that's first back to the nest. It's her mate, Ozzy, who sees their chicks for the very first time. He instinctively moves towards them. The chicks need constant brooding to keep them warm, so they won't be able to regulate their own temperature for at least a week. So Ozzy has a go at brooding. This is absolutely fascinating. I've never heard of male tawny owls brooding their chicks. This could be the first time this behavior has been recorded. The female returns soon afterwards to find her partner in the nest. She pushes her mate off the chicks. This is supposed to be her job. Now Bonnie's back home, Ozzy heads out to hunt, and he's soon back with a rat. She calls for more food. He remembers a mouse that is left by the entrance. This food store should keep him going for a while. One afternoon, Bonnie heads to the entrance to take a look outside. Tony Owls are nocturnal, so seeing her in the afternoon light is a rare treat. And it's great to get a daylight view of the chicks too. They're only a few days old, but they're already developing fast, starting to sit upright and trying to hold their heads up. I can even make out the faint outline of the facial disc. It's incredible to get this unique view of the first moments of these tawny owl chicks. And as the chicks continue to grow, I can't wait to capture every moment. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to see more. Here's a taste of what you'll enjoy seeing on this channel.